Good morning, folks. We've got a couple must-catch news items today. Then we'll cut a bit short here and be back in a few hours with part four of Earth's catastrophe cycle, the solar micronova. Of course, with just one pitiful active region that almost completely lacks sunspots, the sun is currently in the throes of sunspot minimum. Let's go to spaceweathernews.com and find the last 24 hours on our star were aesthetically calm. But as you'll recall, solar wind from these coronal holes was expected to intensify here at Earth and intensify it did. Orange panel up top, pre-impact density rise like snow built up on the edge of a shovel blade, and as it drops out the speed and plasma temperature below in purple and green surge upward. That's the coronal hole stream. Well, the stream is considered modest to above average, but not really at the very strong level. The effects, which can be seen globally, very easy to spot, are in the low to moderate range as solar disruptions go. We have entered the lowest level geomagnetic storm condition here this morning due to that intensified stream. And more should be coming since after this departing opening is out of view, that one on the left will be facing Earth. Good shot of Mayan volcano yesterday. Good news is they do have a number of strong seismic signals, so any pressure release should probably be considered a good sign. Amazing article on gigantic lightning jets, focusing here on the charge separation within the cloud and how those interactions lead to the different types of jets that have been seen. And this type of global electric circuit awareness is being furthered at the student level. We all recall our student, Ferris Wald, who won the National Middle School Science Championship. He is now at the world level in the Google competition and has moved up from solar coronal hole correlations with cyclones to those of solar flares. Good luck, Ferris. We've got your wind maps, followed by shots of our star to close. As we said, part four is coming up, and the solar micronova is what a lot of you have been waiting for. Just a few hours to go. We'll do this news all again tomorrow, right here, but right now it's 4.30 a.m. in the new valley of the sun. Eyes open, no fear. Be safe, everyone. Thank <laughs> you.